All right, check it out, guys. It's Trevor James. We just got into Naples, Italy. Look at this beautiful, beautiful city. And today I'm so pumped because we're meeting up with Culinary Backstreets. These guys go deep for street food all around the world, and they're taking us full on for their signature food tour here in Naples. Let's go check it out, guys. How are you? <laughs> How are you? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So nice to meet you, Kiara, finally. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Trevor. So starting up first with a, <laughs> yeah. a Naples coffee, right? Yeah. You will try my favorite coffee. Okay. It's Caffè Schiumato. I love it because it, it's a little bit different than the macchiato. You know, in Naples there's a long tradition relied oh. to the coffee and the way to enjoy the coffee here. Okay. Buongiorno. Okay, here we are, coffee bar. Yeah. Ciao. Okay, so they give you water as well. Yeah. Grinding the beans. Wow, the beans. That's rich espresso. And now he's using the fresh powder. That's number one coffee in Naples. Si, absolutely yes. Here we go. Then um, the cups must be always very, very hot. Oh. In, in Naples they say that you enjoy the coffee with triple C. So triple C means come cazzo cosce. How much it uh, burns. How much it okay? burns. Okay. <laughs> Number one coffee. And in you Naples. see that the it stops the dripping. Okay. Oh yeah, look at that. This is for you, Tin Tin. Right now, Pink. How's that? So they give you normally the water. It's strong. But, yeah. Just hanging out. See? Get the first coffee. Buonissimo. This is my. It is not my first coffee. The best <laughs> coffee in Naples. Number one. I is saying you cannot find the passalacqua normally at the supermarket because it's a niche product. Oh, number one. Uh, coffee challenge 2020. Best coffee in Naples bar Mexico. Amazing. Best in Naples. Yeah. Mm. Oh, wow. That is strong. It's very, very earthy. Mm. Very Thank nice. So That'll. Grazie, grazie. Okay, so next up, we're just heading to a local seafood market, and yeah, Chiara's we are going us back the there. Back streets here. Look at this. Back alleys of Naples. The Pescheria Azzurra. Uh, they are an institution in Naples because they uh, started uh, till a few years ago. They oh, were look at these only giant fish. a fish shop. Look at this fresh seafood market. They literally have everything here, guys. Anchovies. They got squid, octopus, they got, looks like salmon and tuna and swordfish. It's all here. This Look is the swordfish. Swordfish. So you can get this and take to the restaurant, is that right? Yeah. Needs a saw to cut through that middle bone, right? Yeah. You can just choose exactly what you want and the restaurant beside will cook for you, right? <laughs> La signora Carmela. Carmela, nice to meet you. She is the owner of the place. And here we are, take a look at this, guys. Chiara is bringing us in. This place is busy. So what do we got here? We are getting spaghetti con vongole. That is a must for on Sunday. Okay? A must on Sunday? <laughs> yeah. Okay, and here's the okay. kitchen. Oh, the fried good stuff. Look at this. Oh, look at the mixed seafood. There's squid, there's prawn, there's salmon. It's all in there, sardines. That's the ultimate seafood fry. He's gonna coat it in flour. And look at this, pasta station. Oh, wow, we got so many pastas. Oh, look at this one, lobster with pasta. Look at that. This is the best way to enjoy the mussels. Oh my goodness. Okay, so just open, and then they provide you with just lemon. Little black, black pepper, lemon, and ready to go. Now it's our time, probably, yeah. okay? I put our spaghetti with uh, oh. seafood. Let's see how it's done. Oh, look at this. So we got a seafood pasta right here, yeah, right? these are seafood pasta. Seafood, there's clams, there's mussels. Yeah, this is probably our thing. Oil, a little parsley. So you can see how they make our uh, dish. Oh, yeah. look at that. So we got the signature tomatoes from the volcano. Yeah, exactly. We got clams, mussels. Oh, look at that. And that's our swordfish there. That's our swordfish in the back being fried, being grilled. Here it is. Oh, little parsley, olive oil. Oh, wow, look at that. Grazie. Grazie mille. Let's eat. This is ours. Let's eat. Okay, and here we are. This is the, what type of pasta is this? 
di Sara spaghetti Look at that. spaghetti con i frutti di mare and then uh, wow. these are fasulari belonging to the family clams. of uh, clams uh, mussels mussels lupini oh. okay and then vongole veraci vongole veraci this one here all, all clams but different if you see the shells the shells yeah. are Different, okay. Mm, yeah. And then the tomato from the oh, the tomato from the volcano. Yeah. That's the number one tomato in the world, right? Absolutely. Most flavorful. Yeah. And then we've got the signature. What we saw them cutting yeah. in the market, right? We got the swordfish. Then it was cut, <laughs> and then it is plain grilled. Plain grilled, right? Plain grilled. With a yeah. little bit of parsley, a little bit of lemon, and olive oil, right? And olive oil. And then we got the fried seafood <laughs> basket. Yeah. Right. The Typical cuoco with uh, shrimps, uh, calamari, mm. yeah. zeppole, zeppole with seaweed that you open. Oh, you see the oh, a little bit of seaweed, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Nice. And it's what you find on normally on the paper cone. And now, yeah. buon appetito. <laughs> let's do it. <laughs> okay, so okay. let's go for the pasta yeah. first. Let's, let's like Thank this. you, Kia. Ooh. Okay. Oh, that looks good. Uh, this is a normal Oh, pizza. simple and delicious, right? So the seafood flavor must just infuse into the pasta, right? Yeah, Because they absolutely. add the seafood in first. Absolutely. Right? Yes, And yes. they add the pasta in second. Yeah. Looking good. I want to try one of these. Mm. This is the signature. Infazulari. Infazulari. Okay. Let's try that. Mmm. Mmm. Whoa. Mmm, it's loaded with seafood flavor. It's just so smooth yeah. and elegant. Wow, let's try this swordfish. So you just squeeze a little lemon on, yeah. right? Look at that. It depends on how much you want, okay? Okay. It's like a steak. It almost looks yeah. like a steak. Yeah. It's, it's, <laughs> it's meaty. Mmm. Mm. Oh, it's so juicy. That is the steak of the sea right there. Yeah. It's so juicy. Mmm. I think that's the best pasta I have in this trip. Really? Oh, in my life. In your life. Mm. And I just want to highlight how amazing the tomatoes are in this meal. Those tomatoes from the volcano, right? Vesu right. Vesuvius tomatoes. Vesuvius, opiennolo. They're so packed with flavor and juicy and just unreal. <laughs> mm. Oh my goodness, that was one of the best yeah, yeah, pastas. Yeah. I've ever eaten. Those Great, tomatoes, huh? those tomatoes are just... Sorry, appreciate it. Yeah, we're coming to Italy. Very, for... I, yeah. Amazing. I am very happy you love it. What a hot it's spot. It's perfect. Spaghetti with the claims and mussels and then you knew fasulari it's that you didn't know what were fasulari. So beautiful. Fantastico. Now let's go for pizza. Or a pizza. Let's pizza. go. Okay, and next up we're going for a most famous pizza. Neapolitan pizza. Just crossing the street here. Yeah. This beautiful city, Naples. Naples is amazing. Come to Naples. <laughs> what do you think, Dink? Yeah, and you? Yeah, beautiful. Okay, here we are, guys. Yes. The... Chiara is just saying this is the most historic pizzeria. Yeah. I was telling you about the, the importance of the historic pizzerias in Naples. We are on Via dei Tribunali. Here there are four historic pizzeria, and Vesi is one of these. Okay, grazie. We're all right in the kitchen. Grazie, grazie. Ooh, the pizza's hot spot. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. Oh. Wow, look at this. Oh, Neapolitan pizza. Okay, so we just ordered two pizzas. One margarita and one basilico pesto. And chef here is going to make them for us. Oh. Okay, so we got the tomato, yeah, parmesan, tomato. basil, oh, and then one pesto. That's pesto basilico, which yeah, has basil, basilico. basil, pine nuts, garlic. Oh my goodness! Fresh tomato, tomato, fresh tomato, oh, and basil. Oh, okay. Buffalo mozzarella. Buffalo mozzarella. Ah no, sorry, no. Fior di latte. Fior di latte. Oh, little olive oil. Olive oil. Buffalo. Buffalo. Yeah, you, you oh, recognize oh, it by the milk. Look at that. And that's our margarita. Yeah. Margarita. It's amazing. This is what we came to Naples for. Amazing. Right in there. Oh, and here's the basilico. Pesto. 90 seconds cook. Wow. Show this, show this. Right in the oven. Okay, so pizzas just went in the oven. 90 seconds. That's a quick bake. Oh, there's our margarita. Wow, that's the home of pizza. Delicioso. 
<laughs> oh, look at that! That's are so bubbly. Okay, and there they this are. This is the Neapolitan pizza. That's what we came for. UNESCO pizza. UNESCO pizza. Come oh. to Naples and you will enjoy the best pizza. Look at that. So we got yeah. the margarita. In Bezi. Oh, and the pesto, the basilico. It's hot. Let's go. It's hot. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Look at this guy's pizza in the back streets of Naples. Grazie. Okay, so here we are. Look at that. The basil. Pesto, right? And then yeah, margarita. Like so it's a sourdough yeast, fresh tomatoes, fresh tomatoes, basil, and fior di latta. And the, it the is cheese. a cheese. So we got the pesto, we got the tomato. This one has mozzarella, this one has the. Uh, this is a fior di latta. Fior di latta. Okay, okay. Fior di latta. Different light. Yeah, cheese. it is lighter, you see. Oh, so that's how it's done. You cut it right when you want it, right there. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> let's try it out. Mmm. 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 Oh my goodness. Buonissima. That is so Excellent. flavorful. That Excellent. is so flavorful. Mm. That tomato, that tomato sauce is so is flavorful. That margarita, so simply delicious. The tomato sauce was incredible. Was incredible. Slightly sweet, slightly sour. The dough is like spongy and has this elasticity with the cheese that combines together so well. Okay, next up, let's go for this. Oh, it's so soft. Look at that. This is buffalo mozzarella, right? Buffalo mozzarella. Buffalo mozzarella. This is a triumph for the senses. A triumph for the senses. Yeah, do you like That's it? That's a good one. It sure sure is, isn't it? Triumph because you will feel it in your mouth. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Oh my goodness. Buonissima. That is insane and delicious. Wow. Buonissima. Wow, that is Because a... you taste the, the, mm. the pesto together with the fresh tomato, which gives the freshness. It's really fresh, really aromatic. The cheese, the buffalo, mozzarella, all the tomatoes. Oh my. It's just amazing, guys. Just want to highlight how delicious these pizzas are. I personally am just in love with this pesto pizza. And I think I can just finish this because everyone's full. Look at the flap there. That's the. That's the way you want it to be, just soft and flappy, juicy pizza. Mmm. Mmm. Grazie, thank you. Thank you. Thank you oh my god. That was amazing. The pesto. The pesto basilico. Bueno. Bueno, bueno. What an amazing day in Naples, guys. I want to give a big thank you to Culinary Backstreets and a big thank you to Chiara for that awesome street food tour. They're offering 10% off for any of you guys, any of our Food Ranger followers, for any of their street food tours around the world. They have tons of different street food cities with street food tours just like this where they go deep, they bring you deep into the kitchens to see the making just like we did today. Check them out in the description below. They're offering 10% off. Use the coupon code FR10 to get 10% off any of their tours. Thanks for watching, guys. Definitely check them out next time you wanna go deep for street food.